Hi everybody and welcome to new tutorial in SOLIDWORKS uh, This tutorial is uh, for um, uh, beginners um, uh, who start from zero and uh, who know anybody about uh, this uh, software okay uh, I present for you this week this uh, um, USB drive I am spirit from my uh, USB drive here I take a photo okay uh, I found this uh, part is very useful okay for you uh, and uh, my goal here is how to use a uh, simple sketch and add uh, some feature like extrude pass and cut extrude and add the uh, fillet uh, extrude cut here um, how you can add um, the text okay uh, advanced thing is to separate body okay add two bodies in one part okay uh, to start I will close this I will save it I forgot to add something we will add material when we finish this one okay I will save it and let's go when you open SOLIDWORKS uh, you will find it like this one you have open here and you have new file here click once here and you have to choose one of these three part or assembly or drawing or you can find this like this one it's the same thing but the design is uh, different uh, let's start with the uh, part here click once and click ok Um, here you have the surface uh, user and you have sketch here and feature to start you have to, st to choose uh, uh, one plan okay in this example uh, we start with the top plan okay click once and you have sketch here or you can go to sketch and click sketch here okay if you have not this bar you can uh, you can add it from here click the right mouse button and go to uh, standard views okay when you have this click and drag to this position and leave the button of the mouse and you have this one um, to start go to rectangle corner rectangle click once and start from here click once here and move your mouse to this one and click the second button here okay now to leave this uh, feature just click um, uh, step in your uh, button in your uh, keyboard then let's add some dimension to add dimension uh, go to smart dimension here and add these dimension uh, I measured it in my USB drive click once here and click second here and now we can put uh, numbers uh, or dimension for we uh, for us, uh, let's put 33 here and 12 here. As you can see, uh, when you finish, uh, you have just to, uh, to press uh, escape in your keyboard to leave the last uh, feature. Okay. As you can see here, we have. Uh, uh, zone here that's the zone of uh, drawing or sketching and here the control of your sketch 
and here all of the relation okay to add the relation between this edge and this point just use a control key in your keyboard click here and control press control and hold control in your keyboard and press here now we have this menu and this one the properties is the same thing for us here are the relations the relations make this edge uh, in the mid they make this point on the middle of this edge press midpoint and you have the fully defined of your sketch press ok now let's add a circle a circle just click once here and go to the middle of this one when you touch this edge uh, swordworks ask you if you want to uh, to choose the mid point of this edge click once here and make it coincidence with this uh, point to do that just go to this point and press the second button okay press escape here and now um, you have just to add another circle okay let's see go to the same point and uh, stop here okay for this we will add um, a dimension okay to add dimension go to smart dimension click on here click second here and put nine now we can't extrude this because we have interference with all of these edges uh, to stop this let's use uh, a trim entity the trim entity cut uh, this uh, this edges okay go to power trim and click and drag from here just touch this one okay then click ok now in SOLIDWORKS you can convert entity to convert entity just click once here and you have this menu and you have only this line properties the line properties ask you if you want to make this edge in the option for construction just check on this and as you can see you have this edge is for construction now you can start your um, your extruding feature to rotate your model is just hold the mid po the mid button of your mouse and uh, and displace uh, displace your mouse and you have this um, view okay go to feature go to extrude bus and as you can see the area is extruded for here for dimension one put four make sure this is planned okay then click ok to validate your feature the next feature is extruded cut okay as you can see we used this one now let's use this to start the sketch I told you you have to choose a plan now we can choose a surface but this surface it have to be uh, it has to be a uh, plain surface not a band a band surface okay like this one you can select it and go to sketch from here okay um, I told you to show this bar because um, we frequently use it on SOLIDWORKS just click normal 2 to say normal to this uh, surface okay uh, now you can you can use a uh, rectangle to dress it here or you can choose offset entity when you select this one to deselect just click here okay select this one and go to offset entity and for us let's put 0.2 click here to see the result reverse it like this one 
and click once here okay now go to feature extruded cut as you can see you can return your model like this one and here you can put 8 okay just enter to validate your model now let's um, let's add the fillet the fillet is the feature to modify your model uh, it's here just click once here and put uh, the trip here you have to put uh, dimension before starting selecting edges just put 0 0.1 and select all of these edges this one and this this circle and this circle okay validate your finite model and now as you can see we have only one um, um, we have only one um, body here okay to add another body I will select this surface and go to sketch sketch and normal to and start from this um, rectangle click in this bottom in this um, um, point and end your um, your rectangle here okay add some dimension go to smart dimension add here 1.5 okay then go to feature extrude in the blend choose up to surface here choose this surface okay now let's don't merge these uh, bodies okay that's the one bodies I want to be uh, free okay to make this check off this merge result here and click OK as you can see we have body uh, solid bodies here we have two one and the second okay um, now let's add a name of or a logo of this uh, USB drive to do that just just select this surface and go to sketch sketch here and you have text for the text for me I will put uh, King Stone okay uh, I don't want to be uh, like this King okay stone it's just uh, good like this see from here and as you can see when I click here the text follow uh, the click of the mouse okay let's leave it like this check off this to enter to the properties of this text here you can change to Verdana Verdana okay and just leave it uh, normal and for the units put 2.5 validate and make it in this uh, area okay uh, but you have to make it uh, bold like this one and click OK now go to feature extruded cut and wait sec put here 0 0.1 and press enter press enter to validate okay um, the second thing is to add the same technique select this one go to sketch and I wanted to uh, to add the R okay this one go to <coughs> your text editor and uh, for me I will use sample here and we we'll add the R okay I uh, will copy this one, Control C, and I will go to SideWorks. I'm in Sketch. Uh, go to Text. Here you can paste your model. Okay. 
just leave it like this one because I will modify it on the font uh, for me I will put um, I will put 1.5 and I validate just leave it in this area and click OK of the feature the same thing extrude cat with 0.1 and validate okay now it's time to add um, material to our uh, USB drive to do this um, let's here let's uh, let's choose the um, uh, Chrome okay to do that go to edit material and for the steel choose chrome steel steel apply close and here go to appearance in the scene go to painted sprite and here you can uh, press and drag this material and go to this feature okay the same thing click and drag to the second feature okay and to this body copy to this body okay uh, if you are advanced users you can enter and add other circuits in the um, in the interior of this uh, a USB drive okay we achieved our um, um, our USB drive like this one and you can add other things if you want and add other text here to make 16 gig and um, that's all for all thank you for watching and um, if you like it you can subscribe to my channel to grow my channel and see you in the next episode uh, to improve your skills see you